All right. If you are not operating heavy machinery and um, you are not driving, please close your eyes and take a deep breath in. Let it go. And envision the energy you want to bring into your day. What is the one positive intention you want to carry with you all day? Take another deep breath in. Let it out. But hold that intention in your heart. Let it resonate within you. From the top of your head, down through your chest, down your legs, to the bottom of your feet. Just hold it there for a second. This is your power for any day. No matter what happens, you can always come back to this moment and remember the intention that you wanted to feel, embody uh, today. So uh, I feel like I have to go backwards for a second. I'm just seeing uh, your comment, uh, Sassy G G Ma. Um, Let's talk about that, okay? I'm pretty sure. I know I have your phone number. Um, I'll send you an email first. We can set up a time to talk. That might be the the idea. That might be it. Um, I just got to work. My coworker gave me some apple butter and salsa. Wow. Thank you, universe. More, please. Good morning, soul darn good. Liz, Eric, Stavros, um, Alyssa, Rosie. Um, I like that idea. Um, But I do think I want to see what happens. Like maybe people... When I went live for the full moon last week, hey, Brandy, good morning, Betsyville. Um, And there were people who have been to the morning live. Hey, Leslie. Um, But they can't make the morning live because of their schedules. And so they asked, like, okay, do you do the replay of that? And it's like, well, no, but I will. Hey, Dazzling Events, good morning. Thanks for sharing the live. So, um, hey, Sherry, good morning. Hey, Albedo. So I think I'm going to check it out. We'll see. Maybe there's editing needed. Maybe not. Maybe it just goes as is. Ah, thank you, Betsyville. That's good to know. Hey, Melissa, good morning. So anyway, I'm going to get on with it. Um, but I wanted to let you guys know I got your emails. I hear your concerns. And I am thinking of what's going to be the best thing for all of us. Okay. And thank you for reaching out. I was pretty surprised at how many people were like, hey, girl, no. (laughs) So I am energized and ready to seize the day with enthusiasm and determination. With each sunrise, I welcome the light that guides me to a day of purpose and joy. Hey, Keela. Hey, TikTok tapping. Good morning. Good morning, peaceful warrior. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to let the universe will provide the answer. It always does. So each morning I reaffirm my commitment to self-care and prioritizing my well-being. Good morning, pretty little Leo. Ernie, thanks for the follow. Hey, Wild Mountain Woman. Good morning, Bee Bear, Texas. Thanks for sharing the live. Hey, Yvonne. I am at peace with the past and excited about the present moment. Hey, Timeless Adventure, good morning. How goes it? Hey, Balance Today, good morning. Thank you for the rose, Melissa. I release the past with grace and embrace the possibilities of the present. Each breath I take cleanses my spirit and renews my soul. Hey, Lisa Renee G. Good morning. Oh, thanks for sharing the live tapping point. Thank you. I've been missing you in the morning since I'm walking now with someone else. So I can't walk and talk and tap. (laughs) 
Oh, good. Good, Timeless. That's all right. I'll figure out a way. I like your videos, though. And it's like, where are you? There's so much beautiful nature around. As I let go of old wounds, I make space for healing and happiness. I am strong enough to let go and wise enough to wait for what I deserve. Hey, Lexi. Okay, we'll do some of those. Good morning, Diana. I've been down with a bad sinus infection. Oh, so beautiful, Tapping Point. Just now feeling better. Okay, well, welcome back, Diana. You were missed. I knew you weren't here. I didn't know if maybe... Hey, Leilani, good morning. Thank you for the heart me. I didn't know where you were, but I'm sad to hear that you weren't feeling well. Glad that you're back and that you are feeling better. The power of renewal flows through me, refreshing every aspect of my life. Oh, I like that. We're going to do some affirmations for... Um, interviews. I visualize myself thriving in my new job, creating a prosperous future. I am a powerful manifester and I am manifesting my dream job into reality. So I don't know if you guys noticed or not, but um, both of my mods this morning have, uh, well, usually, I don't know if you guys know this, but they are usually uh, working while they're with us. So anyway, um, we have no mods this morning. I'm hoping there's not a need for them. Planning, planning, new business affirmations, please. Okay, absolutely. That's a good, that's good. Okay, I am deserving of success and I confidently convey my qualifications and achievements during job interviews. It's okay, Janine. Everything works out exactly as it should. I am calm, composed, and collected during job interviews, showcasing my best self with ease. I am worthy of success and I confidently present myself as the best candidate for the job. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I am gentle with myself, recognizing that overthinking is a habit that can be broken with patience and trust. Hey, I'm back, Jeannie Jean. I let go of the need to overplan and allow spontaneity and flexibility to enrich my life. My potential is limitless, and I unleash my full capabilities to achieve my goals. Good morning, Hallie and Shanna and Penny. Good morning. I choose to focus on the good in my life, no matter how small it may seem right now. Hey, good mom. Good morning. I have the ability to find hope and light, even in the darkest moments, knowing that better days are coming. Hey, Siwi. Good morning. I trust that life has its ups and downs, and this moment of sadness will pass. I am open to finding healthy ways to express and process my emotions without holding on to anger or guilt. Good morning, Light. My travels are filled with ease, joy, and wonderful experiences. Oh, two, two, two. Okay, I like it.
I attract genuine and supportive friendships into my life. I release any mental clutter and create a space of clarity and concentration. I attract loyal and supportive customers who appreciate and value what my business has to offer. I have the knowledge, skills, and resources to navigate any challenges that come my way and turn them into opportunities for growth. Hey, Betty. Good morning. Yeah, good morning, Luna Moon. Thank you. I have a clear vision for my business and take inspired steps toward its growth and prosperity. I am adaptable and resilient, capable of handling any task or responsibilities that come from that come my way in my new job. Thank you. Thank you very much. I easily regain focus and bring my attention back to the present moment. I release all distractions and create a clear and focused mindset. I am surrounded by friends who uplift, inspire, and bring out the best in me. I attract abundance and ensure the well-being of my family. I choose to let go of past hurts and make space in my heart for healing and growth. Forgiveness is an act of strength that empowers me to transcend pain and embrace a brighter tomorrow. Oh, no worries, Luna Moon. Never never have to apologize over here. Oh, hey there, Girl Baller Mom. I saw your message. I know you're busy. I just told the group that both mods are unavailable this morning. Um, The universe has been taking care of us, so we haven't had to use any of our um, tools. There's been no one in here that... uh, Good for you, Jamie. I'm happy. Uh, So don't worry, girl. Do what you need to do. It's all good over here. Of course, we miss you. And everything you do, but I do understand, um, you know, that you're doing a lot of other things. So, hi. (laughs) Oh, yeah, the love is real. I surrender to the flow of life and accept things that are out of my control. Yeah, maybe you do just need to listen this morning, girl, baller mom. Okay, I got you just like you always have me. It's all good, really. I focus on what I can control and I release my attachment to the rest. I have the power to choose my response even when I can't control the situation. I let go of resistance and embrace the peace that comes with accepting what I cannot change. Hey, Leilani, good morning. I trust in the wisdom of the universe, and I have faith that everything is unfolding exactly as it should. I am ready and excited to embrace new opportunities. Thank you, universe. More, please. My business is thriving and prospering in every way. Oh, hey there, chilling. I was just saying, it's so funny. I was just saying that neither one of my mods were here this morning or able to make it. And then Girl Baller Mom popped in and then you popped in too. So hello, good morning. You can just listen this morning too if you want. Um, We're at 25K, guys. So we are going to give thanks. 
um, we're going to thank the universe for all the good things that we're experiencing in our lives. I love this. I think this is fantastic. Thank you for the love that surrounds me, a reflection of the love that resides within me. I, I knew it. It was fine. Both of you guys were busy doing things with children. I'm a mom. I get it. No worries at all. It was just interesting. That's all. No worries. I promise. Thank you for the sunsets, painting the sky with hues of warmth and serenity. I think it's just funny. <laughs> Thank you for the moments of clarity that dispel confusion and bring understanding. Yes, thank you, universe. More, please. That I love. Thank you for providing me with the ability to give exceptional value and service to my clients and customers. Hey, Lay. La. I can't pronounce your name, but good morning. Thank you for blessing me with the discipline and focus to consistently work towards my business goals. Oh, Lakita. Okay, thank you, Lakita. Good morning and welcome. Thank you for granting me the creativity and innovation to stand out in the market and attract loyal customers. <laughs> Thank you for the ability to breathe out of both nostrils. I love that. Hey, Jen. Good morning. Good morning, Shelby. That's great, Diana. I'm so happy you're getting better. And <laughs> I mean that 100%. Thank you for blessing my business with abundant growth, prosperity, and success. Yes. More, please. Absolutely. Thank you. Here's my gratitude and give me more of what you're giving me because I'm so grateful. Thank you for the ability to create a loving and supportive family. Yes, thank you for abundant health. I agree. Thank you for blessing me with the confidence to take inspired action towards my goals trusting in my abilities and the support of the universe hey victoria hey josie good morning layla welcome back montreal thank you for the unconditional love that i have for myself i love myself Thank you for blessing me with the ability to prioritize self-care and love myself unconditionally. Thank you for blessing me with the gift of love, which serves as a guiding light in every aspect of my life. Uh, thank you, chillin', chillin'. Thank you. Thank you for the love that flows effortlessly between me and the people I love creating bonds that will stand the test of time. Yes, Jeannie G. Jean, Jeannie, absolutely. That's the most important thing. Out of self-love pours everything else. It took me a very long time to get to that point. Trust. Trust and believe. But once you get there, you see, you just move differently. You treat yourself and others differently. Thank you for granting me moments of deep peace and serenity that rejuvenate my mind, body, and soul. May I request a prayer for my sister who is going into labor soon with her fourth. Absolutely. Do you want to say her name, Hallie? Because you know we're almost at the halfway point. So up to you. Yes, very true. Very true. And you really can't see it until you're on the other side of it. But once you get there, you're like, wow. It's different over here. Thank you for blessing me with the ability to see the silver lining in every challenge I encounter. Raina. Okay, Raina. Thank you for blessing me with a peaceful mind and a calm heart during life's uncertainties.
Thank you for granting me the courage to step out of my comfort zone and pursue my dreams. Oh, Tammy, congratulations. Is this your first time becoming a grandma? Today, I'm going to be 1% better than I was yesterday. All right, because of Christine. Yes, love that. Good morning, SK99. Oh, congratulations to you. Happy first time, Grandma. Oh, oh, you are going to be... That baby is going to... (laughs) Get ready, Tammy. (laughs) I love that for you. Thank you for protecting and shielding me from negativity and harm. Creating a safe and nurturing environment. Yeah, that's a beautiful thing. Thank you for offering me the strength to let go of the past and embrace the blessings of the present moment. Thank you for blessing me with a healthy and harmonious balance between work, rest, and play. Hey, PJ. Yeah, that's fantastic. Thank you for opening doors of opportunity that align perfectly with my passions and talents. Thank you guys for sharing the live. Thank you for surrounding me with a supportive community that uplifts and inspires me on my journey. (laughs) Thank you for my strong immune system. Yes. Okay, guys, so it is 5.30 on the West Coast, which means um, we are going to stop and do two minutes of silence. We also take this time to send out prayers to people who need it. So we're going to pray for Raina to have a healthy, successful, and quick labor and delivery. Um, We can also pray for Laura, Quinn and Finn's friend. Um, And... Um, Also, that Tammy's daughter has a smooth um, labor and delivery and that it just goes really quick. Like people say it could take a long time when you're when it's the first one, but sometimes it goes really fast. So I hope it all turns out uh, quick, easy, and you have those beautiful babies in your hands soon. Um, So I'll start this two minutes of silence, a prayer for my grandma Maria. Okay, Leilani. We'll also send prayers to your grandma, Maria. And peace, love, light, comfort to everybody that needs it. Pray for me. I'm stressed out with my 33-year-old daughter. Yeah, nothing but love and light. All right, guys, here we go. Praying for all that need it.
All right, guys, we are back. Good morning, Terry A., Drea, Shatonia, Terry Bowen. Good morning. Hey, Hania, good morning. This dialysis is soon for a kidney transplant. Yes. Hey, Dazzling Events. Oh, Peaceful Warrior, that's so cool. You always worry about your kids when they go for that first one. Thank you guys for the gifts. I appreciate it. So if you're new here and um, you like these affirmations, you would like to have them. When I'm not live, um, I do have a free audio available in my link tree or beacons, whatever. Click the pink I am circle in the top left hand corner and you can visit my profile. There's a link there to beacons. The very first choice is free audio affirmation. So you click that button, put your first name and your email address in and um, be on the lookout for an email that's going to come back to you with a link to the audio. You can uh, save it to your phone and then you can listen anytime you want. Hey, good morning, Moni Red. You'll be live for several hours a day soon. I absolutely will, Hallie. You're you're absolutely right. Thank you for that vote of confidence. The person with the 33-year-old daughter, she is growing and you both will become closer. Yes, Kathy Harris. Thank you for that. Thank you, Chell. I agree. You know, I was having this conversation with someone yesterday. You guys hear myself and Devin all the time. And, you know, most of the time we're having a love fest. Um, but you know, there was times when, when, like when she went to college, like she really wanted to separate from me. And so she was like, mom, please don't come over. Please don't call me. I was just like, Oh my God, how can you say that to your mother? Um, but of course we got through it. (laughs) So, um, you know, sometimes you got to take a step back to take several steps forward, you know? Um, yes. I mean, and of course now you know, we're, we're thick, you know, we're right together all the time. But, you know, during that time, she really was trying to find herself. And as a mom, any moms in here can understand exactly what I'm saying. It's like, you want them to grow up your whole job. Hey, Angie Bailey, good morning, is to raise them so they can go out into the world and take care of themselves, right? But when it's happening in real time, it actually hurts you. It's just like, oh, ouch. No, I don't want to let go. So, yeah, um, just take a breath um, and uh, just believe that it will. I took a big step back and she took a big step towards me after the fact. So I'm hoping the same for you, too. All right. Now, um, for those of you that are in the room that haven't followed me on YouTube, please go follow me on YouTube. Um, Mommy is so hard. It is. Yes. Yes, I agree, Miss Mia. So we're going to bring up, um, I'm going to bring Janine up and um, we're going to have some Reiki this morning again. And if you want to receive it, just type I accept or I consent in the chat. Bring her up right now. Thank you, Chillin. Janine, good morning. All right. Okay, we're coming back in. We have 39,000 likes, so I assume that we will be uh, coming back here quickly to these thank you affirmations. But in the meantime, my heart is open to letting go and my mind is clear to embrace the peace that follows. I am committed to releasing negativity and cultivating positivity in its place. I embrace the transformation that comes with release and I welcome the serenity it brings. I trust the divine timing of the universe to bring renewal when I need it most. The universe supports my decision to let go of the old and make space for the new. I am surrounded by angelic energy that guides my release and renewal. 
Each ending is a clear path to a new and exciting beginning. Me too. I'm loving those ears. <laughs> oh, I love that, Janine. I am freeing myself from fear and stepping into my power with courage. Yes, me too. It's the same for me too, though, guys. It's like, I always leave feeling on top of the world um, after our lives together. I just feel great. Um, we set our intentions and then I'm ready to go out into the world and be a badass, like our book. It's like, yep, I'm going to live up to this 1000%. I am open and receptive to the abundance of options available to me. The power within me is limitless, fueling my journey with courage and tenacity. I am a force to be reckoned with, fueled by the endless reservoir of strength within me. I am surrounded by positive energy that uplifts and supports me. I am a deliberate creator, setting intentions that resonate with my heart's desire. Oh, wow, girl baller mom, is that true? We need to talk about that. If you haven't filed for student loan forgiveness, today is the deadline. I have all kinds of questions about that. I release any doubts or fears and affirm the power of my intentions to manifest my dreams. I know, I just saw that too. I did before, is that still valid? Yeah, that's a, that's a good question, girl baller mom. Maybe if you have a moment after this, you can help us. Each intention I set is a seed planted in the fertile soil of the universe, ready to bloom into reality. Well, just to add on to that, um, hey, Batya, hey, Katya, good morning. Um, I have a friend who just had $165,000 forgiven that they've been paying on for over 20 years. And that just happened like last week. And <laughs> just texted my kids to make sure. All right, Miss Krabs. I know that's crazy, right? I know. I was so happy for him. Like, because he's got the doctor, you know, he did all the things, but he's been paying, paying, paying. And um, he, it just got, he's done. It's one time opportunity for all loans, private Perkins, forbearance, etc. Thank you, girl baller mom. I know both of my kids already applied to that, but do they need to do something else? Do you know? Good morning, Ma uh, Marianne Moore. How are you? How's Bella? Every challenge is an opportunity to tap into my creative potential and find innovative solutions. Um, I don't know the website, but if you type in student loans, I think, um, look, we're having a, see, look at this. Look how great this is. Love, light, kindness to all today. May God's favor be yours. Thank you, authentic self. Yes. Keela, um, I believe we have to go again. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, at least we know. Letting go is a process, and I honor my progress as I release attachments gracefully. And at least we didn't find out tomorrow. We found out today, so we can do something about it. Thank you, Girl Baller Mom. I love and appreciate my body exactly as it is right now. My body is unique and beautiful, and I celebrate its individuality. Yes, Keela, I'm right there. Oh, look, you didn't put it in there. Thank you, girl. Take a picture of that. Awesome. 
I am grateful for all the amazing things my body does for me every day. I let go of comparisons and honor the beauty of my own body without judgment. I release all negative thoughts about my body and replace them with love and acceptance. I am worthy of complete healing. And I embrace it with an open heart. My body is a miraculous vessel capable of restoring itself to perfect health. With each breath I take, I am inviting healing energy to flow through me. I am in perfect harmony with the natural healing rhythms of my body. I am surrounded by a loving and supportive community that aids in my healing journey. My mind, body, and spirit are in perfect alignment, promoting healing on every level. Each day, I am getting stronger and healthier in every way. I release all resistance to healing, allowing the universe to flow its curative energy through me. I invite healing energy to flow through every organ, tissue, and cell promoting optimal health. Hey there, Angela, you did make it. Good morning. Good morning. Divine timing, you're right on time. And you'll probably get some thank you affirmations before you go. Look at there, look at that. All right. I know, Mrs. Krabs, that's what I just thought. I mean, literally, we're going to uh, sneeze and we're going to be there. <laughs> hey, OG, good morning. I am important too, and taking care of myself comes first, so I can be there for others. And we're at 50K, just like that. What did I say? I am kind to myself, showing self-compassion through nurturing self-care. Oh, I am my own advocate making self-care a priority for my happiness and fulfillment. Yes. Yes, we are authentic self. That's why us coming together here every day, there's so much power. And so many people send me emails and messages to tell me that so much has changed since they've been coming to this community, since we've all been commuting together. And I believe it. I believe it. All right. Thank you for the chance to appreciate the beauty of resilience and transform my pain into strength. Yes, thank you, Universe More, please. Thank you for that information, Girl Baller Mom, because that would have just went right by me. That would have went right past, okay? Yeah, this year has been, um, yeah, this last year has definitely changed my life. And I don't know if you guys journal, um, but... I love to go back and see what I was thinking about a year ago. Like, where was my mind? What was on it? What was I working for? Um, so if you're not journaling, you probably should. 
Thank you for the joy and peace of mind that comes from knowing I always have more than enough money to meet my needs and desires. Thank you, Result Slayer. Thank you for the gratitude I hold for every financial blessing that comes my way. Thank you for surrounding me with the shield of love and light that protects me. Thank you for the ability to create a safe and harmonious space within myself. Hey, GG, G and G, good morning. Yes, thank you, universe, more please. Thank you for the synchronicities and signs that affirm I am on the right path of growth. Thank you for the opportunities to expand my skills, talents, and knowledge to reach new heights. Hey, Kimmy, yes, good morning. So you guys are able to send um, Janine gifts from this live if you want to. And um, wow, Sherry, that's pretty amazing. Wow, you guys are gonna have so much information. That's positive. Um, also on Janine's page, she has a link if you wanna send uh, tips. And yeah, stay hydrated, stay hydrated. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you for the moments of clarity and inspiration that lead me towards my true potential. Oh, thank you, Kat. See, Janine, there you go. There's some gifts for you. They're sending you roses and hearts. We appreciate you. We love that. Thank you. Thank you for the profound transformation that occurs as I embrace the process of growth. I love that. I love that you guys just sent gifts to Janine. That's so sweet. Thank you so much for that. Thank you for the continuous growth and expansions that enrich my life every day. Thank you for the roses. <gasps> oh, thanks for the confetti. I love that confetti. That is so cute. I can't believe how much I've missed them. Um, and I was just such a staunch, like, I am not doing that. <laughs> so my, I have a moon in Taurus, hence the stubbornness. Thank you for the opportunities to learn and grow, allowing me to reach new heights. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> right, Janine, you feel me, huh? <laughs> hey, we're all a work in progress here, all of us. Thank you for the love and grace that surround me as I embrace my journey of self-improvement. What you grew and let it go. Yes, I did, Sally. Yes, I did. Thank, uh, thank God, thank the universe for growth, okay? <laughs> ah, thank you for the awareness and mindfulness that enable me to navigate growth and grace with acceptance. I did have my reasons, Darcia. You're right. And they were good. But a lot of people reached out to me and they were like, okay, we understand, but can you? And I thought, I'll think about it. But I, you know, whatever. The past is the past. We shall think of it no more. <laughs> Thank you for blessing me with the ability to adapt and evolve in a rapidly changing business landscape. And you did, and I appreciate that, you guys. I appreciate that so much. You all respected my decision. And even though you wrote to me about it, you nobody was like, you need to do this. It was like, I really, hey, Jane, good morning. It was like, I really understand where you're coming from. But, you know, it's a way to express ourselves. And uh, thank you, Terry Bowen, for the Cash App. I'm taking all Cash App now to buy music. Can y'all see my comments? I'm just now seeing you, Mandy Ray. I did not see you before. Ah, uh, look at that. Hand hearts to you, Miss Janine. Thank you for the opportunity to offer love, compassion, and healing to my inner child. <laughs> I know. I know, Sally. Everybody said that. Wait, what? gifts. <laughs> Thank you for the grace to forgive myself for my imperfections as a parent and to always strive to grow and learn. 
Thank you for the confidence to embrace my flaws and imperfections, recognizing that they are part of my journey and contribute to my growth. Oh, hey, Jane, we don't have a replay for the book club. It's so interesting that you're asking that question. Um, it says that in our in our emails, um, we haven't been recording. Um, I thought I recorded for Sunday and it didn't record. So um, I don't have a replay, but maybe I will for the ones coming up. I'll have to find some place to um, to host it, you know. Abraham Hicks workshop, I would have loved to be there. Thank you for the self-assurance and belief in myself that propels me forward. I bet. I would love to be in one of those. I'm loving that too. Okay. Thank you for granting me the ability to face challenges with unwavering confidence and resilience. You know, Sydney, we haven't decided. There's been a lot of, um, there's been a lot, um, yeah, that's true, Jane. That's very true. I was thinking that as well. Someone else told me that. All right, so it's 5.55. Thank you, Betsyville. 8.55 in Jersey. And um, I want everyone to say thank you. Thank you so much, too, for sending gifts to Janine. Um, we really appreciate you, and I always love the Reiki. Um, I'm going to let you down now. Thank you so much. And please come back tomorrow. <laughs> we hope so. All right. Yes, 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 yes. All right. Five, five, five. So I think we're going to go out on some, well, I'm going to do some gratitude. I'm feeling very grateful this morning. Pretty much every day, but. I don't know, just lately, it just seems like everything I want is happening. And Jane, you're right about that, but it's funny because there was, um, for some reason, usually every single Zoom is automatically recorded and it wasn't. So, sorry, but this week will be, so I hope you can make it. I am grateful for the abundant blessings that flow into my life every day. We appreciate you, Janine. Thank you for being a part of our community. By expressing gratitude, I attract more opportunities for prosperity and abundance. I am deeply thankful for the financial abundance that constantly flows into my life. Hey, Kimberly, good morning. As I express gratitude for the present moment, I open myself up to experience true joy and happiness. Yeah, because if you think about it, even when you're having a hard time, even when you're having a bad day, good things still happen during those days. It's not just a constant series of bad things. Don't get me wrong. There are days like that where they call them um, like Murphy's Law, that everything that could go wrong goes wrong. But for the most part, there's always some type of light involved. And I think that's God's way of saying, okay, I understand um, that you, <laughs> you're you going through something, but guess what? There's There's light on the other side of this. As I express gratitude for the present moment, oh, I just said that one. Well, I love it but I won't repeat it. By appreciating the little things, I cultivate a mindset of abundance and attract greater wealth into my life. Yes, as the saying goes, every day may not be a good day, but something good happens each day. Yes, Sally, very true. That's what I was working to convey. Thank you for that. Okay, girl baller mom. Yes, I love that. I am grateful for the peace and serenity that fills my mind, allowing me to navigate life's challenges with ease. Yeah, actually, let's pin that comment. I like it. That is from the book we're reading. 
Oh, wow, Keila, thank you so much. All right, guys, before we leave, we need to say a prayer for Frida B. She is in surgery right now, I think. Um, re having three of her, something in her neck is being replaced with a disc and a rod. So, yes, I will thank you, Keila, so much. I did forget. Definitely will pray that she everything comes out okay. With every breath I take, I am grateful for the miracle of life and the endless possibilities it offers. Oh, thank you for the heart puffs. Thank you for the roses. Gratitude fills my days with an overflowing sense of love, leaving no room for fear or doubt. Yes, free to be 1970. Um... She's having three of the discs in her neck re re removed and replaced this morning. Um, she was in our live too for the book. She's reading the book with us. I don't think we're gonna see her on Sunday. So um, it is now 6 a.m. on the West Coast. I'm going to do uh, one more affirmation on gratitude. Um, gratitude opens my eyes to the miracles that exist in the present moment filling my life with wonder and awe. Um, yeah, I want to send out some healing energies, some peace, love and light, and also praying for the surgeon's hands that are working on Free to Be 1970. And I'm going to just be silent for about 30 seconds, okay? Thank you guys so much. I bought the audio version because I'm driving. Don't really have time to read the book. The audio version is fantastic, Batia. It's so good because the author's reading it herself. Danielle, I saw your message right when I started my silence. So definitely sending peace and comfort to you and your family during this difficult time. Please accept our condolences. Um, so yeah, listening, listening to that book is probably, you're probably laughing up a storm, uh, while you're driving that big truck of yours. So mm. the audio is great, isn't it? <laughs> Timo Beta is agreeing. Yeah. I love this book. It's really great. And I really feel like, I felt like, uh, I just visualized everyone in the surgery room complimenting each other on how perfect the operation. Thank you, Victoria. Thank you so much. Thank you for the cash app, Anna. Thank you. Yeah, Jen Sincero, she cracked me up too. I like chapter four, the big snooze. Yeah, so I feel like a lot of the things that we're reading in this book, I've, I've come across before, but the way that she's packaging the information, like I definitely wrote down the five things about the things I'm working to change in my life. And I feel like once we get to the end of this book club that I'll be on another trajectory. You too, Leilani, thank you so much. The name of the book is You're a, You Are a Badass. And it's um, Stop Doubting. Oh, it's in my office. Okay. Stop doubting yourself and start living an awesome life. And it is just great. There. So if you go to the link in my bio, I have a free 30-day trial to Audible. You can sign up for that. You can listen to that book and any other book that's um, in my Amazon store or anything that's in Amazon that, that's in Audible. And you can listen for 30 days for free. So... Yeah, the book is fantastic. Listening to audio and reading physical for highlighting. Yes, Lisa Renee G. I love that. You're welcome. You're welcome. Um, this is a fantastic book. I don't know what the next one is going to be yet. Um, we've had we had a suggestion on Sunday of what the next one will be, so I'm not sure. Um, but it's fantastic. So anytime you get new information in your brain, it's a good thing. So I want to thank um, 
everybody for being here with me this morning. Thank you, Chillin, for um, moderating. Thank you, Girl Baller Mom, for being here and telling everybody where to go to get rid of their student loans. Um, I think it was Lexi has an um, interview today. Um, much success to you. And I will be back here tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. And um, I still haven't figured out how it's going to go. Oh, you're welcome, Jordan. Thank you so much for being here. Where for student loans? Hey, Linda, Linda. You're welcome, LAB. Thank you for being here. Um, wow, that's so interesting. Okay, let me go back because she, she typed that in a while ago. I just think it's go just go to Google and type in student loan forgiveness. Hey, yes, I got the job I wanted. <gasps> Congratulations, high vibrations. Thank you, universe. More, please. You too, wild mountain woman. Thank you so much, girl baller mom, especially since I know you're working. Oh, you're welcome, Sherry. You have a great day. Thank you, Janine. Thank you. Appreciate you and congratulations. Fantastic. I love when everything goes the way you want it to go. Good for you. Oh, so that explains all the forms I've been receiving last couple of weeks for loan forgiveness. I guess so. I thought my kids had already done that. So I'm going to have to thank you, Marcy. I'm going to have to take a look at that and see what's happening. All right, guys, I will be back here tomorrow morning at 5 a.m. And um, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Take your intentions with you throughout this day. And if you run into any obstacles, just put your shield up. Thank you, universe. More, please. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you tomorrow. You're welcome. Bye, guys.